can see a potential where so many patients will be helped, so many healthcare systems will be strengthened. And at the end of the day, when we're discussing health equity and access to healthcare, Pfizer will be mentioned. Two years ago, Pfizer established a cord for a healthier world to help close the health equity gap for 1.2 billion people in 45 lower income countries. Driven by our purpose to deliver breakthroughs that change patients' lives, we've listened, learned, and collaborated to enable greater patient access to healthcare. And what I think is important is that we are responding to the request from the government, and we're responding to that need. During the field visit to Rwanda in 2023, a specialist confirmed that his first set of patients had commenced treatment for a debilitating chronic disease using an innovative medicine supplied through a cord. In Rwanda, those patients would not have had access to the medicine for a very, very long time, if ever. I have a lived experience in the region and I understand firsthand what it means for someone to not have access to the breakthroughs that Pfizer is currently offering. I did some best practice sharing with the Ministry of Health and their teams. They're planning to begin to use some of what we've shared in part of the development program for the colleagues. So for me, I think that was a way to impact the community beyond just providing our medicines to them to ensure that the medicines that we're providing remain effective by the time they get to the patients. I remember the very first training, that healthcare professional training that we did in Rwanda uh, when Accord was launched. And when I look at the progress from then to now, how many patients we've impacted, not just with COVID-19 medication, but when we look at all other therapy areas like oncology, and that's breast cancer specifically, when we look at rheumatology, when we look at infectious diseases, we've impacted so many patients. Behind our progress is a dedicated team of Pfizer colleagues from across functions who are working every single day to make our vision a reality. I see the Accord team as a purpose-driven set of colleagues, totally dedicated and committed to ensuring Accord is implemented in all the lower and low middle income countries of the world. It's amazing being part of a team that wakes up every day to be able to make sure that no one is left behind. The challenges are big, but we are committed and focused on providing solutions for generations to come. The wheels of Accord grind slowly, but they are grinding definitively, purposefully, in the right direction. And it's evolving because as we're learning, we're fine-tuning the program to better suit the needs of various countries. I think the accord and the engagements that we have with governments each and every day, it's revealed to us the importance of what we're trying to achieve.